Hey guys, it's Megan. Today we have a wash haul. So I have recently gotten a Lush store that has opened near me. Uh, they redid a ton of the domain area here in Austin and brought in a bunch of new stores and I am excited to say that one of them is Lush and so I have one only like 10 minutes away from my apartment so it's both dangerous and very, very wonderful. So <laughs> I've taken a couple of trips to Lush since it opened. So I thought I would kind of throw everything into one bag since I haven't used any of it yet. And I wanted to show you guys. So we will start with Rose Jam Bubble Rune. This is a bubble bar. So you break it off under the water in your bath and it will f create bubbles. And this is the scent of Rose Jam, which is my favorite scent from Lush. And I just love it so, so, so much. This is probably one of my favorites from Lush. I always buy it whenever I am in need of one. And yeah, I can't wait to use this. I'm so excited to start taking baths more now that it's getting cooler outside. Can't say cold because let's be honest, it's Texas. But I am so excited to take more baths and that's probably gonna be one of the first ones that I use. Next, we have another bubble bar, and it is called Granny Takes a Dip. And I always like to joke that I'm a grandma in a 23-year-old's body, so this is perfect for me. And just to describe it, the scents are ginger, pepper, and lemon oil. And it's supposed to turn your bath kind of psychedelic and super colorful, and I, I'm just excited to try this one. I've never tried it before, but it smells really strongly of lemon and ginger. So I think I'm gonna love it. But I just think it's gonna be fun colors. I'm getting more into picking stuff for the color than going specifically just for the scent. Though the scent is still important to me. So I thought I'd give this one a try because it looks like it's going to make a very pretty colorful bath. And on the opposite end of the spectrum as far as color, we have Milky Bath, which is another bubble bar, but it's got a ton of glitter on it, so I'm going to put it down. I'm not going to continue holding it throughout this description of it, but Milky Bath actually apparently has a new formula, and it is shaped like a milk bottle, as you saw, but it also has cocoa butter and soy milk and olive oil for super soft skin, and that's another thing that I really look for when it comes to Lush products. I want stuff that's going to really make my skin feel nice and that's one of the reasons I love Lush so much because really everything makes your skin feel that way. Now I have glitter everywhere. <laughs> Why? But yeah, I, I really am looking forward to trying that one. I think it's going to be somewhat similar to the, um, what's it called? The Butterball, which just has a really soft kind of vanilla milky scent to it. I think it's going to be similar to that, but I'm really excited to try that one. I might try mixing that with something else. For example, I may mix it with the other item I got during that trip, and it is the Floating Island Bath Oil. This one smells of vanilla bean and sandalwood, and this used to be a bath melt, if I'm not mistaken, but they've changed it to an oil now and it's melting in my hand, so I'm gonna put that one down too. But I think that that mixed with the Milky Bath, Milky Bar, Milky Bath, what was it called? I don't remember. I think that, I think these two mixed together would be really, really nice, so I may give that a try. But I just love Lush, and they both smell amazing, and I'm very, very excited to give them a try. And since my first trip to Lush, they have come out with all of their Christmas stuff, which don't even get me started. I was so excited about. <laughs> One thing that I got last year that I knew I was going to have to get again this year is the Peeping Santa. Look how cute this is. It's got little chocolate chip shaped things. I think it's chocolate chip. For eyes, like how cute does it get? I don't think it gets cuter than this. But the, the Peeping Santa bubble bar. I'm pretty sure this is a bubble bar. Yeah. Yeah. So this is another one of the ones where you break it under the water and it creates bubbles in your bath. But this one smells like strawberries and almost like strawberries and cream. 
And I loved this one so much when I used it last year. So I'm really, really excited to try this one again. Oh, yes. So good. And then last but not least, and this is one that I'm so excited about because I've never tried it before. And it's called Nevermind the Ballistics. I think this one's new, at least to the USA. And this one is a citrus bath bomb. I love citrus and I love super, super sweet, like baked good scents. So I'm really, really excited about trying this one out. I think it'll be super, super nice. Mm, I love that. So yeah, that's everything for my Lush haul. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And if you did, be sure to hit the like button down below. And if you're new here, please hit subscribe so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. I try to post twice a week, but let's be honest, that never happens. So I post kind of sporadically. So if you are not a watch YouTube every day kind of person, then I might be just the YouTuber for you because then you only have to watch me every now and then when I actually post. So, hope you guys are having a great day, and I will catch you in the next one whenever that is. Bye!